Hey everyone, this is Sebi from Valorant Central. Welcome back to another video on the channel. So in this video, we're going to talk about the latest news that we have about hackers being punished in Valorant. This includes the bans they will receive and how strict the banning system actually is for these players. I for one am really impressed with how Riot Games has handled cheaters in their game, and I'm sure you will too once you hear everything they have done. Before we get into all of that, be sure to subscribe to the channel to stay up to date on all things Valorant. We post videos like this nearly every day covering everything you need to know about the game. Also remember to drop this video a like if you do find it informative and helpful, as we really appreciate it. So just yesterday, upon the full release of Valorant, there were some players who were unable to play. These are the players who were caught cheating in the closed beta and were banned then. Now from my understanding, these players obtained some form of cheat, used them in the closed beta not thinking much about their actions and then were later banned for this. And then they contacted Valorant support and were told they would be given a second chance upon the full game release. Well these cheaters had a real rude awakening when they realized that they were still banned from Valorant even when the full game did come out just the other day. Now some of these players really wanting to play the full game have even started messaging Riot Games representatives complaining about their issues and the responses they're receiving are actually hilarious. Here is an image tweeted out by the Riot Games CEO. A former Valorant cheater sent them a message on Twitter saying, Hey man, I was just wondering. I was one of the players that used a free cheat and was really excited to hear that we would be given a second chance to learn our lesson and I have. I just have tried to play today with a new account and I got removed with you have been banned from Valorant. Anyway, this is a mistake or you guys just didn't lift bans. And then the Valorant CEO simply responds with sorry, no second chances for cheaters. Now this is great, such a simple response, but it truly is perfect. I think they are handling this very well, the situation with all the cheaters. There is really no excuse for cheating at Valorant and clearly Riot Games isn't putting up with it. I believe it is important to be strict now as it will definitely deter people from cheating in the future. If they were to give these players who once cheated a second chance, they would have to give so many other people a second chance as well. And out of these players, there will definitely be a few who will try to cheat again. So it's better just to not let any of them play the game again once they have cheated once. Now when it comes to the actual ban these players are receiving, it is not just an account ban where they can make a new username and account and still play, it is actually a hardware ban. For those of you who don't know what this means, it basically means that their anti-cheat system is able to track the serial number on their computer parts and not let a computer using these parts ever play Valorant again. This means that in order for these past cheaters to be able to play Valorant again, they essentially need a whole new computer. Even if they were to go and sell these parts to other people, those people who bought the parts would not be able to play Valorant either. The parts will completely not work when trying to play Valorant. I'm actually quite impressed with how this is all being handled. I know there was concern in the past about having cheaters in Valorant, especially since there were so many being seen in the closed beta, even with such a prestigious anti-cheat system as Vanguard. Now I for one can't really comment on the safety of their anti-cheat system, as I know there was a lot of discussion about it when it first came out, but with that aside, I do think that they are handling the situation with cheaters in a very good way, and I definitely think it will help prevent having more cheaters in Valorant in the future. Let me know what you think about this punishment that the cheaters are facing. Do you think it is too harsh for a first time cheater? Or do you think that what Riot Games is doing is the smartest decision? Leave a comment down below with all of that. Also remember to subscribe to the channel, stay up to date on all things Valorant, and drop this video a like if you did find it informative and helpful. That's about it for this video and thanks for watching.